What's good, y'all? Welcome back to some more Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. The last time we landed here on Windfall Island, got our sail, and we played hide and seek with some jits. Today, we're gonna hop on the King of Red Lions, and we're going to set sail. Lego! Oh, I did not mean to hit that. Time to set sail, everyone! Cause we're heading to that island, over there. Come sail away, come sail away, sail away with me. Now, we're gonna be doing quite a bit of this in the game. So, I'll be sure to cut out some, if not most of it. Since, wait, what's that island over there? I kind of want to know. Let's go to that island over here first. Before I do anything. But yeah, I'll be sure to cut away most of this throughout the, uh, throughout the adventure. Get out and see what's over here. I think we technically don't need to be over here until later on. <laughs> Just got some grass, all I need. There's a mailbox. <clears throat> Get up, Link. Thank you. What's the sign over here? Read. Okay, so that's the island we're going to. Dragon Roost Island. Just, just mowing, mowing the island. Don't mind us. But yeah, that island over there is where we need to go. So... What the fuck yeah. is that over there? I should know, but... I don't feel like knowing. Let's get in. And let's once again set sail. Now there is a reason we're going to Dragon Roost Island, so... Let's go over there, shall we? See that? Oh, we see an enemy over there in the distance. But I think as long as we don't go on that boat, he should pay us no mind. The seagulls right over here, just going with us. At least I think they are. Oh. Why don't you look at that? Hey. There, on the horizon. That is our destination link. Dragon Roost Island. Ah, y'all remember this song? High atop this island's peak lives the spirit of the sky. A, a great dragon by the name of Valu. You must go see this dragon and request him a jewel called Din's Pearl. Ask the people of the Rito tribe who inhabit this island about how to see the dragon. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. Wait just a moment. This is the Wind Waker, the name of this game. It is a baton of sorts that was used long ago when people played music in prayer to the gods. In those days, simply using it allowed one to borrow the power of the gods. 
but I do not know if it still works. Th then why are you giving it to me? Even so, I thought it might be of some use to you. Perhaps you should try using it. I guess. First, conduct in 3-4 time. Do not touch the thing. Just try to match the rhythm by tilting the C-stick up, down, and right. Like so. Very nice, that was splendid. Next is 4-4 four, four time. Hold the circle button to change the rhythm. Then match the rhythm and tilt up and tilt the C-stick. Up, right, left, and then down. Like so. Just like that. That's it, Link. That was not bad for your first time using the Wind Waker. Not bad at all. You can also conduct with it in 6-4 time by tilting your stick right. You would remember to... You would do well to remember that. And we got the Wind Waker! A very, very important item in this game. Alright, 6-4 time. Alright, and it's a good thing we got it because we're gonna need to go, I think, this way? Hmm. Actually, no. Where do I need to go? Because you learn your first song... ...somewhere. I think we're gonna put the sail away. Or the, uh... Microscope thing away for now. Oh yeah, there's rupees in this. Uh, there's rupees in there, so be sure to collect them. Oh, we also got bombs. Let's grab one. Oh, out the way. Boom! Make that rock go explode. And we got a yellow rupee for our troubles. Boom. Yeah. Okay. Yep. There is a certain spot we need to go to. <clears throat> yep. This. And yeah. Oh, that was close. Hmm. Am I mistaken or something? I might be mistaken. Oh, wait, 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 wait. It's through here, it's through here. Okay, I'm tripping. I'm, I'm tripping. Here, we're gonna learn this song. So let's grab our Wind Waker. Here's a song we're gonna learn. It's a very important one. We learned the Wind's Requiem. Here comes this guy. Mm. Yep, there's some mad and nice breeze. <laughs> Name's there, folks. I'm the god of winds. So you're new so you're the new wind waker, are you? Right, great, for a beginner. 
even got a nice wind sense patch. I like it, kid. That tune you just picked up? Well, it gives you control over the direction the wind blows. Depending on how it's used, wind can be a good thing. Or a very bad thing. You want an example of it being a bad thing? Then you should see my brother. It saddens me to say that my brother, Cyclops, is mythful about his monument here being broken. And now he spends his time creating cyclones to torment people with. So if you encounter any cyclones to see, chastise my brother for me, will you? And that is my request for you. <laughs> I see. Alright, well, enough of that. Let me have my sword real quick. Alright. Never mind. Alright, so now we can start making our climb up. But, unfortunately, the bridge is out. Whatever will we do? Well... Trying to read the sign. Do not, do not attack the explosive fruits. Easier said than done, bud. Okay, well, that was a other massive fail. I just wanted to break that rock. Okay, so we took some unnecessary damage. It is what it is. Oh god. Oh, that could have been so much worse. <laughs> that could have been so much worse. Holy shit. <laughs> okay. We're gonna want this. Boom. Just like that. Oh, cool. I'll take that, thanks. Oh god. Let's sidle along here. That's the only way we're getting across. God, I love this music so much. Can't help it, I love it. And as you can see, we can only carry a maximum of 200 groupies right now. Oh god! That was rude. I just completely missed. Alright, let's try this game. This time, we have more feeling. That's better. Let's go across. And oh, we meet again. <laughs> Link. Link, is that you? It is. I am pleased to see you're okay. I must say, you've traveled far for one with no wings. And your sister... Is she... Well, about that... Is that so? Well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll hang in there. I have an idea, Link. Would you like to meet our chieftain? I told my people here about you, and all of us Rito are very concerned. I'm certain the chieftain will befriend you, and lend you the aid of our Aerie. It's settled then. I'll fly on ahead and let everyone know you're coming. Come inside, Link. I'll be waiting. Kaka. What a nice cereal box. Alright, let's venture forward. Let's see what we got in store here. I already have enough rupees, so I don't need to open those vases. Or break them. <clears throat> Look at him! All the burbs. Well, have you discovered the cause of the great Valu's anger? Oh. 
Oh, so you are Link, are you? Quill has told me all about you. A troubling tale indeed. I insist that you let us know if there is anything we can do to help you. We shall do everything in our power to assist you. Well, I'm gonna need like an AK-47, uh, probably a new ship, uh, maybe some cannons might help. Maybe some bombs. However, in the meantime, we have a problem of our own to deal with. When you arrived on the island, did you notice the raging dragon perched atop the mountain? As you can see, we of the Rito tribe are profoundly connected to the sky. We make our livings on the airways. We do so by the graces of the sky spirit, Valu. When a Rito reaches adulthood, he or she journeys to the top of Dragon Roost to receive a scale from the great dragon. It is this scale that enables the Rito to grow his or her wings. Recently, however, the once gentle Valu has grown violent and unpredictable. Sadly, we can no longer approach him. <laughs> if this continues, the fledglings who are, who are of eight will never be able to receive scales from Valu on Dragon Roost. They will remain wingless, and in time, our very way of life will be threatened. <laughs> As chieftain of the Rito, my first responsibility is to solve this problem. My apologies, but I must ask you to wait for our assistance until this is done. Will you do so? Sure, man. Chieftain, what do you think of consulting Link with regards to your son, Prince Komali? As you see, Link, as you see, Link is a gallant young lad. I feel certain that Prince Kamali would open his heart to him and speak freely of his fears and worries. That may be. Let me be direct. My son Kamali is of the age to earn his wings. Yet, he is weak, in some ways, and in light of the current situation, he may just give up on ever getting them. What say you? Will you share some of your courage with my son? Will you meet with my son? Sure, man. <laughs> I thank you. We shall do our best to solve our problem as quickly as possible. So that we may, so that we may be better, so <laughs> so that we may better help you with yours. I have something I wish for you to give to my son, and no, it's not the AK-47 you requested. A young girl named Medley is holding it for me. Will you find her and take it? I am counting on you. Way to force me to do chores, dude! Here, Link. Take this with you. Who knows? It might come in handy. We got a delivery bag! We can pocket as many items as we want! You should find Medley in one of the upper rooms. Leave the Great Value to us. <coughs> Excuse me. I had, a, I had a bubbly beverage before recording. In the meantime, do your best to aid Prince Kamali. Well, that's going to have to wait until the next episode. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to hit that like button. If you guys want to see more and you haven't already, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you don't miss out on future videos. 
next time we're gonna go find Medley and see what uh what it is we're gonna give to Prince Kamali. Yeah, I know you're tired too, Link. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.